Hello my dear students. Welcome back to our new video lecture of science. So today we are going to start fourth chapter soil. So let's start. Students see the picture. Mayuri is looking at a handful of soil from her garden. Then list any five different things she would have found in it. List any five. Okay. Children, soil is very important for life on earth because all the plants grow on soil and animals including human beings are dependent on plants for food and oxygen. Okay. Students, can you tell me what soil is made up of? Yes, it is made up of tiny bits of stones and mud. Let us see how soil is formed. Soil is formed by the breaking down of rocks. The sun's heat, the rain and the wind also help in the breaking down of rocks. The process of breaking down of rocks lasts for thousands of years. So students, huge rocks break into small particles by the action of wind water and heat to form soil. It is a slow process which took many years. Okay. And over time rocks break into very smaller pieces. Students, soil is formed by wearing away of stones and rocks by wind, water and roots of plants. After thousands of years they are converted into a fine powder called sand. When the sand mixes with organic matter, those tiny particles mix with decaying organic matter that is dead plant and animals to form soil. Soil formation is a continuous process. Students, soil is very important for the growth of plants. Students, have you seen soils of different colors? Okay. What do you think affects the color of soil? See the picture. Different colors of soil. Okay. The color of the soil differs from place to place. Isn't it? Soil may be light brown in one place and dark brown in another place. In India, red soil and black soil are also found. Students, we will continue the lesson in the next session. Okay? Thank you.